everybody, it's Lindsay here today, and for today's video we're going to talk about um, the inauguration of the governor this past week as well as the General Assembly last week, and then the Congressional inauguration that happened earlier um, in the month as well. So we're going to do a short recap for you today. Um, so we'll start by talking about the governor's office and the constitutional officers. So this past Monday, uh, Governor J.D. Pritzker took office at the uh, BOS Convention Center in Springfield. Um, also along that day that took the oath of office was Lieutenant Governor Juliana Stratton, uh, Treasurer Michael Frerix, Comptroller Susanna Mendoza, Secretary of State Jesse White, and Quam, um, Attorney General Kwame Raul. So they all have taken their oaths of office and have now um, are transitioning into their office teams and, and the governor is building his administration. Um, so we'll see announcements coming out here in the new future about more and more appointments to um, agency directors and, and different things like that. Um, so he is, he is now in office. Prior to that, though, the week before, um, the state uh, legislature got, had their inauguration. So we saw approximately 37 new representatives um, take oath of office, as well as approximately 15 new senators. Um, we congratulate all of those that have taken office over the past week um, and look forward to working with them in the future. And we've been, we've been meeting with them. Um, we're, we're talking to them about chiropractic and, and the issues that some of our physicians face. And so we are definitely um, you know, ready for this next legislative session and looking forward to working with them in the future. Also, um, earlier in the month, the um, congressional the congressional offices had their inauguration as well. So there was a new Congress that was seated on January 3rd. There was approximately 10 new U.S. Senators and approximately 101 new um, U.S. Representatives. So this week is NCLC and Mark Abel, the ICS Executive Director, Dr. Julie Bird for the ICS um, Treasurer, and Dr. Cindy Howard, the ACA delegate, and um, the SACA groups are all out in D.C. this week meeting with these new congressional leaders to talk about um, some of the issues facing chiropractic like TRICARE, Medicare, as well as a number of other issues as well. Um, so we wish them the best of luck this week. Um, look forward to our Facebook page for any updates or any any information they bring to you live from NCLC. Um, so we, we hope they have a great time and we'll catch you next week.